Okay, so uh, here we are training again. Right, DNAV uh, map combat unit. That's the stuff that I'm wearing today. It's the British combat uniform DPM uh, temperate for the British Armed Forces. So, if you guys oh. on Hades want to grab variations of that? Excellent. We'll do. Like. Thought it'd be kind of fun for us to run the UK stuff instead of the American stuff for a change. As long as it pisses someone off, I'm happy. Well, we'll see when they come down the line for the <laughs> campaign, what they say, but I thought today would be kind of cool. Okay, uniform. User entered your channel. DNAV gets in. So we got six for Haiti so far, so. Okay. Um. I don't know who's slot to steal. Should I just go for an unnamed? Yeah, I just went for an unnamed one. one. We gotta update that. It's getting to be a little bit ridiculous. We got a bunch of guys on on the Hades list that aren't even in Hades for months. And a bunch of new guys going as Jando. Yeah. Check your fire. User joined your channel. Okay, okay. Come, sir, one, two, five. What is it doing now? Uh, repeat last. Comes check one two five over. Lima Charlie one two five. So, what would be an appropriate weapon to take, Sim? I put a bunch of the weapons over there, uh, guys, uh, over here, so you can take a look at them. So you got your M4 variants. You got your. Uh, 762 variant, your FN, FAL, your M14. Back over there by Devil is the M14 and M21 sniper variants. Um, they don't have the M16 for some reason that I can just lay it down. The M16A1 would be the M16 variant that we would be using. They got the M60 Pig automatic weapon and some M4 Colts. And sidearms would be M1911A1. It would be nice if they... Do they have the M19 cool? Yeah, they do. Oh, good. Because that would be the standard. Yeah, I grabbed another 45 myself. Yeah. So 45 caliber 9 millimeters would be your standard pistols. Good to see the old FN. The sights are going to be a lot more rudimentary. I'm using the M16 carry handle magnifier. It's a really rudimentary sight. Sniper sights are pretty much the same thing. They're basically a straight-up sight. Yeah, I'm using the LRPS hunting yeah. sight. Because it's pretty much the most simple one. I dropped all of my ballistic computers. <laughs> <laughs> so I can't cheat. Yeah. It's annoying because in the arsenal it doesn't actually say what uh, caliber they're gradiated for the sights. Typical. What size did you say? The, for what? The rifle? Yep. Uh, 
I'm using a carry handle sight for the M16. Uh, they did have red dots available in period, guys, surprisingly enough. Not illuminated ones, just the rear basic ones. Uh. So like the Seymour, those existed. So if you want to use a red dot, that's the closest you're going to get. The idea here is there's nothing fancy about them. Oh, what is going on? I'll be back. <laughs> and if you want to pack night vision goggles, generation one. Or that monocular. I think that mono, the AM PVS 14, is probably close to shitty as they had back then. But I haven't tried it. I didn't think they had any. They don't, but they're gonna say we're gonna they have did, them. but they're very basic. Yeah, they oh, were like shit. a scope. They were like a telescope that you look through. It was a image intensifier. Which uniforms are we using? I'm packing the uh, British uniform, the DPM. So it's a combat uniform, DPM TMP the BAF. So that's their temperate, their jungle combat uniform. And for my anti-tank weapon, I'm packing the Veneral M7287. That'd actually be the A1. Which mod is that under? Uh, the uniform? Yeah. Uh, underneath of the BAF one, it looks like uh, Third Commando Brigade ones. It's got like the rifle and the wings and all that. The three Commando. Okay, I've got no idea what I'm doing here. You say for uh, anti tank again? The uh, L. 7-2-A-7 well, I can't it's a law it, it's, it's going to have a blue star beside it, it's from RHS it's down just past the M6 light mortar and moss ah, gotcha. yeah. they're bunker busters and now I need a rifle <laughs> what are the options? well, the M16-A-1 is a good rifle the Colts are lighter and snappier, and they're actually a lot of fun to shoot. I've had fun with the Colts, but I thought I'd pack the Jam and Jimmy today, just historically. Oh, okay. So are you guys going to join us for our Hilo training? Thor? Yeah, we can do. I, I don't know what's uh, what we've got planned, if anything. Okay, because nobody else is showing up. So uh, let's see. Atlas, Thor, uh, Dyson. You guys showing? There were some in the uh, barracks room. A few of Artemis. Yeah, I see yeah. up there. And Dnav. Dnav's Hades. Uh, which of these titles do you see red dot again? Uh, the the Seymour is the standard red dot. Seymour, gotcha. Seymour. Uh, what is that? Seymour. So we didn't have um, any uh, metal detectors today. Sorry, what? Any metal detectors? They had basic metal detectors. Yeah, come on, they invented those like before the Second World War. If you go under the... Yeah, uh, I got this one, but I got yeah. the other one as well. If you want to use this one, you have one. Yeah, I'd say the, big, the, the bigger and uglier and bulkier, the better. Cause that's so, the, get, yeah, get, one of, get me up the one with the backpack on it. Yep. Whichever one's going to be big and heavy and a pain in the ass. I need this one because it's my actual pistol slot. It's 
Hope's coming down for training. User joined your channel. Oh, there you go. There he is. Thor, which one of you guys, you or Pope, want to take your team? I'll talk, I'll talk to Pipe. Okay, okay uh, uh, what's, what's the gun you got? I'm trying to find out. I've got the M16A1. What's the, what's it in there? What's in the model S? What's under? I'll check for you. Yes, yeah, I'm trying to find that one. It's right at the start, like if you go down alphabetically, you'll see M16A1. Ah, yeah, I'll, I'll keep my model list, just keep it, you know, simple, but yeah, I'll do that in a sec. Yeah, yeah it's right, through the arsenal alphabetically. NIA arms. <laughs> yeah, DNAV, they wouldn't have any sort of silencers for our rifles. And that sight system looks way too modern. Well, he's not even in the barracks. He's not in the room. He's upstairs in barracks. Whoops. User left your channel. What kind of shitty grenades did they use? Uh... Oh, I don't hear the User joined your channel. User Anything joined your channel. Mark 1 is probably safe. <laughs> Pretty much, yeah. Mark 1 is safe. Mark 1 is safe. These Osprey vests, the Mark IIs, aren't safe for period, are they? No. It would be something like Alice. Yeah, oh, my weapon. Yeah, yeah, the I Warren see, and I Alice. The, the, uh, the PLA, well, PL, PL, are the plates safe or no? PLCE is Alice wear. So, PLCE yeah. webbing, and I took a plate. So, I got the back plate. DPM, temp, TMP. Uh, same, night vision, yay or nay? Since I grabbed yeah, Gen 1s. Gen so one, night vision be... goggle gen ones or grab a monocular a monocular if you want to get really nightmarish. No, I'll, I'll take that gen one the uh, MVG goggles gen one, yeah. Yeah, they're better than what we'd actually have. Yeah. <laughs> so. PLCE webbing plate DPM TMP. Yep. Yeah, the TMP yeah, means temperate. Yeah, yeah. So that's the, the British are actually quite intelligent about it. They actually make sense with their stuff. Not like the Yankees, where they'll just have a pattern and it's like, okay, if you don't know this the pattern, then you have no idea what it is. Yeah, these, these are quite old-fashioned now. These uniforms. That's why I grabbed them. Are we not <laughs> taking GPSs at all? Yeah, probably no. not. Oh yeah, you keep that in mind. What about radios? We we'll keep regular. our radios for now. Okay. I'll keep the altimeter watch because I feel like I'm broke uh, without GPS it. off, radios on... Uh, so what kind of backpack should be wearing, Sin? Say again? Uh, keep long range or lose long range? Long okay. range what? Radio? Keep the long yeah. range. Yeah, keep uh, the good box. Got one. Okay. Yeah, if you're too I see, keep it. Okay. What are the, uh, what was the British standard for handguns at the time? Probably the Beretta, I think. I know. Or the Webley. Yeah, Some Webley or Beretta. <laughs> Yeah, I'd get the Webley revolver. Yeah, I'm I'm the, yeah. I, I think it probably would have been the Webley revolver. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna keep my 1911. <laughs> oh no, GPS. So, what weapons are the ones to pick? The PLCs. Are these Mark VI helmets good or no? No. I know what's the scope. Do I have a yeah, scope? Yeah, I got the Mark VI, but I don't think it's period. It's more modern. Alright, I'm gonna just keep a boonie helmet then. Boonie hat then. Yeah, boonies are okay. Yeah, because I can't find the helmets for the period, so I'm just trying to figure out what's safe or not. Hey, Paul, can I use this Skype? Is that no one that's good for? Here's a quick tip, guys. Uh, I the... don't know. Nah, the PLCE a... webbing. Yep. Doesn't look any different, but if you grab the plate one, it's actually got ballistic and explosive resistance. Yeah, because it's yeah, got a metal just... plate in it, it weighs quite a bit more. It hasn't. Which, though, if which, not which is period specific. I mean, you could just slap a fucking steel plate between yourself and your. Well, uniform. they had flak jackets. Yeah, flak jackets. Yeah, but they did it. have plate it's technology. Good. Plate technology had been around since like the Civil War. No, but I'm just saying, the, visually, yeah. if you look at it, it's exactly the same model. There is no yeah. plate, it's two yeah. straps yeah. over your shoulders, and that's yeah. it. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> I I remember reading about that in the Civil War. If you 
if for you were caught wearing one of those steel vests, you were branded yellow belly because you didn't want to get shot. <laughs> That's not surprising. <laughs> Go America. <laughs> what kind of pack should we wear, Sim? I just grabbed uh, one of the BAF ones the, with the same pattern. So I'm packing the Bergen DPM. How'd you that? And I grabbed the B version because I think it had a bigger load capacity. I don't want to shock it. What else do I need to take? Oh, Got remember, if you're, the, uh, if you're taking the if you're taking the M16, smokes. make sure you bring the 20 round mags, not the 30 rounds. Yeah, plugs need it. Plugs need it. We don't need the RR strobes, do we? No, we don't need them. Nope. No. no Why the 20 rather than the 30 round mags? Because then? the 30 round mags we have are static rags, and they weren't around until like the 80s, 90s. They tried 30 rounds for special forces. Yeah. And they they had. But them if we're going like standard for their... issue US stuff, yeah. it's the 20 round mags. True. There are like the two times mags, but I don't think they work. They look like they're just two mags that have been duct taped together at the end, but they don't actually flip over and give you another 20 rounds. Which and is limitations. Uh, and no limitations to medical stuff. No, we'll grab full med. Don't don't limit ourselves to that because. We're not going to change it down, so... Has the bucket list been changed? No. No. The gun is the M60, probably, guys, so... Yeah, the yeah. M60 is the standard for America. It's a good weapon, it's just What would just the British that... have? I have no idea. I think the British were still using the M60. I can't remember so what they, they were using. They were using, using the Bren, and then, then, the then they would have had the Was G it the Browning? G or the Bren hat? LMG. Oh, yeah, I've only done my research in the area. Oh the god, American this scope. Oh. Yeah, that's why I don't use the yeah. scopes on the M16s. They're annoying as fuck. The sights are just enough. Yep. I'm gonna use the scope because I wanted to give it a try. I've never tried it before, and it's annoying as fuck already. I, it's like, oh god. It's hideous. Don't look at it. Yeah. I'm carrying. I'm <laughs> carrying nasty. the M203 as well. All right. So uh, for Hades, we're gonna have two fire teams. Sim and Vaz are fire team leads. Um, we're going to give some other guys, uh, Devil, you're going to be flying the helo today for us, but when we get the helo down, you'll join it with Bravo Team, which is okay. under Vaz. You'll be his number three man, so I'll make you a medic. Jedra, you're going to be my medic. I'll make oh, you a medic. God. I've got a take gear. Much of that. <laughs> yep. Drunk. Drunk. Oh, and right, Dina are both split. going to be auto gunners. Grab yourself M60 loadouts, please. Save the ones you got if you got yourself a nice loadout. But uh, grab yourself M60s and grab about four to six hundred rounds of ammo. Don't go nuts, okay? Okay. Yes. Uh, do otherwise, we need it's just too or? fucking much. <laughs> do we need but you said the R7 2A7 was okay, right? Mm -hmm. I got my UD stuff. Don't know about explosives or not. The M2, the M7 2A7. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Making sure. I hate that. Tracks. Add that on. The Mark 1s, I think. Yeah. Um, I don't know if the pineapples were era specific, but they might be. If you want anybody to pack extra ammo for the machine gunners, take it out, put it on the ground, and let the guy pick, let us pick it up and take a look at it. Okay? So. <sighs> what did you say? Because I know. What for grenades? Right, cool. I've got my yeah. standard I'm wearing kit only, but I do not yeah. Look for the look for the pineapple I've got frags. The one, got the mine the hand well, I can't remember yeah. what they're actually called. I think they're Mark Twos. Yeah, Mark Two fragmentation. Yeah. And um, now you got some. I know the M60s can hang the M246. Two forty nine. It's my good luck. Boxes, jump. so okay. make sure you're not taking those by accident. You want the two underground ones? <laughs> The 50 round soft packs are good. As well as the 100 round belts. It will take me home. The belts just look a little ugly. Yeah, so use the 20 round mags if you're grabbing an assault rifle or battle rifle. Oh, 20 round mags. Uh, yeah, they're, they're totally scroll, you have to scroll down on the mags to find them. Yeah, they're there. Okay, I need to they're totally somewhere in the middle. Ah, uh, 20 rounds. I'm taking the M193 bags. Ah, found them. Wow, I'm only rolling in at 34 uh, kilograms. Which one? Do you want the M19 or the M85? 
Oof. Should we oh, drop I mean... our helmet cams? Uh, let's keep them for now. Um, we're not gonna use the C tab. Well, shit. If you wanna, yeah, dump the weight. We're not packing C tabs today, so. I'll dump up multiple 20 mile max uh, things. Go. If we're gonna play the campaign, I wanna play the campaign hardcore, meaning we're not gonna get any of our fancy shit. So, oh, I don't know if HQ feels things. the same way. But for training, it's another that's 20 did you take? Oh, so the HAT is M262s? Okay. I don't know what the timing on them are, but they're timed. I just need to take this one out. Oh god, got a bad ugly color on that west. There we go. I'm carrying oh. flares and illumination, just in case. Yep. Oh, I forgot about those. I totally forgot about those. There are regular illumination grenades, too. Right. Okay. There's a bath head mounted uh, NV, isn't there? Hand signals, hand signals, we hand signals, yes. I can't believe how little kits I'm carrying. Yeah, right? I was nuts. I'm at like 30 uh, kilograms. I got, four hand, I got four green hand signals. I need to find the actual flares. Where's the flares? So what we'll do, guys, is make sure you're carrying night gear, but we're going to practice daytime at first. For this, we're going to practice helo insertions, dismounts, and security. And then we'll go through and get it down so we're getting off the helos fast enough. Does uh, Artemis have a pilot? Don't think so. Okay, so I'll drop our Chinook I down. We're gonna... Okay, well, I got some Hueys over there. We're going to walk over and take a look, and I'll mount to set us up a Chinook for our mission. Uh, yeah, what, what was the uh, players under there? Handheld players or whatnot? They would be under. Gr they would be part of grenades, I think. Yeah, I've got the actual smokes just being trying to find flares. So we're taking 152s, yeah? Yeah. Radios, yeah. Yeah, keep our radios, unfortunately, we, you know, it'd be nice to go as much voice as possible, guys, so let's try and stay off them. Okay, okay. Use them for squad level, back and forth, and things like that. But, uh... The M18s are still good for smokes, right? Yep. Hey, uh, Sam, what was the binding for, uh, interactions? Okay, it's your, cu your, uh, custom one and custom two. Custom one is climbing and jumping. And custom two is getting in vehicles. Send up controls. Control. Configure. And. And it's uh, basically the drop down is custom oh, controls. God. And it's use action one and use action two. Control. Custom control. Oh, oh, yeah. Get some max. I have one out. It'll be your trailer max. How many? 41. How the hell have you got 41? <laughs> the 20 round you mags. Uniform, you guys the, 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 the 20 round mags. They're light numbers. as hell. I've got 22. Because you're using the same thing. Light. I'm using got, the standard. Got, I'm using the same 20. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's it's broken. I'm carrying 10 uh, 20 round mags and like 30 grenades. <laughs> 41 here. Yeah. <laughs> so what's a relevant um, machine gun? Oh, Alex. M60. Yeah, M60, I believe. Oh, Alex. Uh, Gen 1 night vision. Um, I'll bother with night vision. There's too much illumination. I'm carrying like 30 illumination grenades. Don't worry. Yeah. <laughs> if yeah, I, if I, we I, need I, to I can't, see, I can't we'll see. Those. King, what yeah. magazines are you carrying? Sim. Yep. yep. It the 20 round M9 Oh, yeah, down, 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 What do you mean? If I press F1 and F2, I get self interaction. Uh, oh, okay. Mark okay. 1 illumination okay. grenades under okay, regular so grenades, and if you're your carrying an M203 no. grenade launcher, there's also the illumination oh, we'll flares. Into... I did not know that for. So that was the set up your ace interaction keys configure. Well, yeah, I was talking about those before. I don't think they actually flip over and work. Configure that on. Can we and take the E4? Common, 
and then your self Which interaction, one? your interact key toggle, M60 and self interaction key toggle, and clear I don't the other think ones. So. I think that's nah. late. Yeah. Was it the one nine threes you took, King? The one nine threes are what I'm taking. What the M seventy nines we can take, can't we? None. The ammunition I got was the twenty round sag M one nine three. But I did not know that was actually that. I'm, ta I'm taking a double take it. I'm taking those. I'm also jumping like three years ahead of the beginning of Vietnam and taking the close prong com uh, compensator. And remember, guys, our rifles don't have silencers. The most you could get is a flash arrester. Okay. So, one of the things that I was told by a buddy of mine in the Princess Pats was they had a simple rule it's tap, tap, move or you're dead. <laughs> So they would shoot twice, and then they would roll left or right, because the idea was the enemy would shoot back at the flashes. Dina, are you using the boxes from the M249? Nope. Which, uh, Which box is that? I don't remember the M60 having a box. Which HE's do you take for the uh, 203? It has a mixed uh, bag. Oh, so. probably just your basic. 40 millimeter high explosive grenades doesn't yeah. really, yeah. Right, yeah. Right. Ignore oh. the outfit. Ignore okay, the outfit. Yeah. Guys, uh, it's invited amazing. everybody in Hades yeah, to Hades. the team, so make nice. sure you're taking that invite. Get yourself grouped. Sorry, guys. I know you're going through it again and again and again, but grenades. The Mark II fragmentations, the M18 smokes, and if you're feeling frisky about it, bring the Mark I illuminations. Okay. Also, if you're feeling extra frisky and you're willing to commit war crimes, bring incendiaries. <laughs> <laughs> They're really dangerous to everybody else around you. Yeah, don't don't bring the incendiaries. I've had way too many accidents. Which smokes did you say? Sorry. The M18s. M18s, thanks. Yep. I think there's a regular Whoa. white you can take, but I we don't shouldn't. remember which one it is. Honestly, that's loud. They're all white insane. don't work, does it? The white works. The white smoke grenades are always useful, but like... Sometimes the AI I can see through them like assholes. That's why I use the yellows. I was told that the whites are the only ones that actually work to block the AI. That's why I pack them. Do you want yeah, us to I bring any yellows? I'm carrying explosives. Red and green. No. White highlights, Mark One illumination, Mark frags, yellow smokes. Where can't I find the? Uh... I'll keep it on the white highlight, so if I accidentally throw something, it's just a chem light. Also, when are we going to be allowed to rig up our tanks with uh, chem light launchers? Probably never. Okay. Can I take the flame from? So is everybody ready? Let's, uh... <laughs> oh, what second, did you I, I got my gear, I need to redo it. Yeah, I'm just going to take the flame from. The M72, remember once you use it, just dump it because that is dead weight after that. Faz, are you gonna join the team? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Still in the crate. Yep. <sighs> okay, so remember, guys, all of this can change at a moment's notice. I'm not in command. I'm just doing the training for today, and I thought it'd be fun to try this, so. I like that we're all in the right camo except for Devil. No, he's got, uh, his Actually, this is period Gilly. correct, uh, No, I know, I just mean, like, Gilly. all of our patterns match except for yours. Yeah, that's because of your salty woodland. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what was the team again? The teams are, for Hades, Sim, Drunk, Jedra, Vaz, Dinav, Devil. And then Thor, Atlas, Dyson, and Hope are... The Artemis team. So we'll call them Charlie for today if that works for you guys. Yeah, so Alpha like is my cool. team. Bravo is Vaz's team. Charlie is it's Pope or Thor? So you right. sorry? You guys you don't... Any medical well, yeah. yeah, and I gave uh Devil's got medical and Jedro's got medical. So let's head over to those helos and take a look at some birds that yeah, are we period. Yeah, we just got to decide who's going to, to be uh, team lead, that's all for... Yep, I'll be in a second. Charlie, heading right over to the helos. Right, let's go then. Damn, I'm only 40 kilograms.
DNAV, you should be red. <sighs> da, 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 da. Oh, helicopters. Love flying the Huey. Huey. You need a secondary for power to keep me in mind, okay? Well, they're tricky. Um, Hell no. Does everybody make it? Good. All right, so I sprung up a couple of aircraft that are period. Of course, the U.S. Marine Corps stuff. <laughs> They've been modernized. The real Hueys are a lot shittier than these little guys. So these are the UH-1 Hueys, and over to the side there is the Sea Stallion, which was like the Marine Corps' big aircraft. And then further back, I put out a Chinook, modernized Chinook. Sadly, it's not the one with the machine guns on it. So the big thing to remember about these, the Hueys is, um, in period, they only had two blades on their rotors. These guys have a lot better lift capacity than the actual period ones. I'm not sure of the maximum personnel capacity on them. Um, but they're a good they aircraft. 12 or 16. Say again? I think 16. Like 12 or 16. Yeah, and they can pack a lot of guys. Yeah, in the Vietnam campaign, we could get quite a lot of us into one of, one of those. Yeah, well, they're good aircraft. The Stallion is a, a really big aircraft. A famous video showing them getting pushed off the aircraft carrier at the end of the Vietnam War. And then, of course, the Chinook packs, what, 20 guys plus? Yeah, it's, I think it's 26 total, Jeez. including the crew. I know in the Falklands, they, used, they could cram about at least 30 odd in there. Wow. Okay, so what we're going to do today for training is we're going to practice doing some dismount insertions off the helo and then deploying and moving then coming back and then forming up a perimeter around the helicopter landing zone, getting the helicopter to come in, land, and then pick us up. It was really rough the other day with how we did that. In fact, it was a clusterfuck. Embarrassing to me. We were in really sad shape. It took three minutes to get the aircraft off the ground. Really truthfully, it should take less than 30 seconds. Once that bird is spotted, hits the ground, people are on board. So we're going to try what I call, uh, we're going to do a, a security perimeter around the aircraft, basically forming wedges. Now we've three fire teams, so it's going to be a little bit different than normal. If... Uh, I'm going to do the training as if it was just Hades' team, so we're going to have our Alpha and Bravo teams do it. Uh, Thor, Pope, if you guys want to do an aircraft practice dismount with one of the aircraft for your teams and see how you guys do it, what I recommend is, is doing wedge in front and then having your number four man looking back, and that'll give you close to 360 coverage. When we collapse, when we do the uh, training mission, we'll only have one aircraft. So then what we'd be doing is we would take... Basically, I call it slicing the pie. We would move the pie around. So instead of having a group directly in front, we'd have a group at 1 o'clock, a group at 5 o'clock, and a group at basically around 9 or 10 o'clock around the aircraft, with the front of the aircraft being 12 o'clock. And they would be forming wedges outside. So let's just walk over and take a quick look. So get in your fire team. And let's move over to this, uh, the left-hand side helo. And we'll do the pie. So, each of the teams gets their guys in their formations. So this is Bravo, Alpha team, Bravo, Bravo team would be to my right. So, Bravo team would be to the right of Alpha team. Yeah. And then, Bravo. Charlie team would be basically behind us. Roger that. Who's requesting a Zeus? Who, who got killed? Uh. <laughs> How did Pope get killed? <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, we're missing the third team, so... You guys gonna come over and get near... 
that's this, this helicopter? Yeah. Artemis, you guys are on the far side, setting up your wedge. Or half a wedge, anyways. <laughs> there we are. Yep, half a wedge, because we haven't got enough bodies. So that would be a quickie formation. Now, the thing about boarding the helicopter is that we basically do what's called a collapse, and then teams mount up. Let's head back in. Head to the front of the helo, guys. Everybody head. Everybody head over to the front of the helo. Yeah, one helo. We're gonna try one helo. So we're gonna do like I said. We're gonna slice the pie, and it's gonna go around the circle. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. Basically, about four clock hands off of each team, starting at one o'clock. 5 o'clock, 9 o'clock, and forming our wedges. That'll give us 360 security. When the aircraft comes back, what we do is we let it land. So we're looking outwards, doing security. The aircraft lands. As soon as it lands, the reverse team goes in first. So the highest number team goes in first. So that means Charlie team. As soon as the aircraft lands, you guys sprint to the bird and mount. As soon as you're mounted, your team lead says mounted, but actually... Bravo team lead should be looking over at that helicopter, glancing at it. As soon as he sees their fourth guy getting in, he sends his team in, announces mounting. They mount up. I should be watching them because I'm the alpha team lead. I see they're closing in. As we're doing that, we're backing in and closing our perimeter because, after all, we're not going to be standing right close to the helicopter when it lands, right? We're going to go over and form a perimeter around it. So I'm moving my team back like this, looking at it, and then it's like, okay, alpha mount. I turn around, I watch my guys get in, and I get in. Does everybody have their user action two key set? Roger. Yeah. Roger. Yeah. Yes. yes. Then if you look at me, you notice I can actually get in from the front of the aircraft. Hello. So, as you can see, I just ran up to the front of that bird and guy got in. So you can literally run up to that aircraft, any position, and grab a seat in it if you have the user action key. That'll save time. Time is life, right? Didn't it also have a problem in the last mission we did in the fourth castle? P two people did it at the same time, they couldn't do it. Uh, let's all circle around the aircraft. Oh, fuck. Let's all prepare and mount. Mount. Yep, don't land me. Yep, kick me out. <laughs> yep. Yep, kick me out. On board. On board. Yeah, okay, so gotta make sure you don't all pick the same spot. I just put the uh, big to Ryden back. back. Yeah, I just picked Ryden back. I'm in. That's what I'm doing too. Well, what if we out. go dedicated seats, then it shouldn't be a problem, should it? Yep, in real life we would go dedicated seats, so let me take a look at the seat assignments. So we got pilot, riding back, observer, passenger right, passenger left. Okay, so, why don't we do this? Charlie team's first on, so let them ride in back. Bravo team's second on, let them ride in the right. Alpha team's third on, let them go passenger left. Does that work for everybody? Skip it, okay? Yep, what good. Kicked me out again. Oh. Don't let me load. Yeah. Not allowing me to get in there. If multiple no, people hit me. it at the same time, it doesn't work. Doesn't? Nope. But, but what if only one team does it? Then it shouldn't be too much. Now we are three teams. Yeah, the big problem is that if everyone chooses the same seat, so if everyone chooses left bench one, no one's getting in. If everyone hits right and back at the same time, no one's getting in. Ah. Okay. Well, why don't so, we? So, so for the left and right, you have to assign a number to everyone, and they take that number to seat. Yep. It'll work fine. But for Charlie team, because all of us only have one button to hit, it's not going to work. We so why don't we? One one. Okay. Well, Charlie, you can just go in by uh, like uh, number one, take right in back, and then you divide yourself. Because uh, those seats yeah. that are busy will be grayed out, and then Bravo takes the next available one, and so forth. Or we could do an assignment. It's not hard to get seat assignments. Yeah, the like, problem is riding back. 
Right in back will always be a problem because there's only one button. These AT weapons are going to be hard to use because they've got a 50 meter range. You're going to be on top of that tank. <laughs> What's the range on the 279? Same to you while talking the radio because I can hear you over here. Yeah, none of us can hear you over here. Yeah, we can't hear Sim at all. Okay, here I am. Hang on. 100. There, yeah, sorry guys, I went to whisper mode. <laughs> so 100 for the channel. So, normally we're not going to mount everybody at once, right? But if Charlie team takes it so that they grab the observer seat, one guy takes the ride and back, one guy goes right, one guy goes left, that'll get them on real fast. Okay. So just pick who's gonna go where. Hopefully. <laughs> what we want the is the server right and back. The one. <sighs> so you. I'm right passenger. Bravo team mount up. I think I'm oh, I can't mount up. I don't get the menu. Alpha team mount up. How did I get stuck in bitch? Alpha 3 on board. Alpha 3 on board. Oh. Charlie team on board. So, remember, right and back, left and right. So we're gonna go remember that. It's Still got one man outside. It's observer, oh. right and back, left and right, in reverse order. Is the yellow full? No, there's one more seat. Right. He's got right bench 3. I can't access it. You should see a ride and back or a passenger. I only see side arms and hands. You got that key set to something else. You did not set it to custom action two. I did. User okay, joined the channel. That might be the um, secondary bonding in the um, ace. Yep, so you have to clear that okay. key. If you're using that, whatever key you're using for that key, you've got to clear it. I'm using my Numad period button. I'm using the arrow front. Kind of like, uh, if you want to enter something, it's in front of you. Yeah, the map's still not in. Yeah, he's, he's changing his keys. All teams, let's dismount, set up a perimeter. Devil, are you, can I, Devil are you on this channel? Yep. Roger that, channel 100. Uh, why don't you uh, bring the aircraft out, we'll throw a smoke down by the uh, gates over there northeast of this position, and you can bring the aircraft in and we'll move out. Hey, fam. And whoever's on the skid, I would advise you not saying Everybody that. dismount!
waiting for you to smoke. Roger that, we're gonna move over towards the wall. I can never stand up straight again. Teams, let's move over towards the north. Um, Charlie team move. Teams form perimeter. North is 12 o'clock. Charlie team go 9 o'clock. Alpha's on. 1 o'clock. Bravo's hat. Charlie team set. Smoke out. Pilot, smoke out. Say color. Smoke out, say color. Uh, green. Negative, negative, wave off, wave off. Smoke out, say color. Oh boy, is he going fast backwards? I'm not seeing it. I think I'm having a rendering issue, give me a second. I'm not seeing any color, I have color smoke either. Holy crap. Because it's white. Nasty blue. Uh, blue smoke. Roger that. That's our LZ. Halo inbound. Teams prepare to mount. Charlie, Bravo, Alpha will be mounting in that order. Oh, here we go. Charlie team, get ready to mount. He's yeah. overshot. Adjust the perimeter. Charlie team, mount up. Charlie team, move. Alpha team, start closing, and Bravo team, start closing the perimeter. Bravo closing. Yeah, skids work differently to the um, wheels. <laughs> Bravo, mount up. Bravo, my thing. Come to that. Charlie team, all aboard. Roger that. No, no, it's still getting there. Sorry, pipes. Pipes here. Watch your face on the back rover. Someone just went there. Very close. Bravo. Right Charlie team aboard. Bravo in. Charlie team on board. Bravo in. Alpha 3 on board. Dust, dust, dust. Yeah, skids, skids, and wheel ain't the same. <laughs> there we go. That was not bad. All right, circle around a bit, and uh, let's do another landing, and then we'll set up a perimeter. The helicopter will dust off, and then we'll move around a bit, and then we'll call you in again. Okay, Devil? Hey, sir. All right, so pick an LZ and drop us down, and we'll perimeter it, and then move out, and then call you in. Good work, everybody. Good comms. What was the soundtrack from the Predator when they were fleeing the U.S. in the beginning? Huh? <laughs> Probably fortunate, son. <laughs> we need to spin that shit. It's always fortunate, son. Uh, I don't think it was fortunate, son, in the movie Predator. Come right. Team's prepared to dismount. Three slices. One, five, and nine. Alpha, Bravo, Charlie. All teams. Dismount. Charlie, team nine o'clock. Alpha 5 Alpha's on the 1 Dust, dust, dust Charlie's on the right Did he just shower us with flares? <laughs> yeah, and <laughs> chaff <laughs> Alright, let's get up and move around All teams, let's head out the gate to the northeast. Bravo. Oh. Bravo stepping up. Charlie team in the middle. Charlie.
Charlie team moving. Alpha's up the rear. Uh, let's go left, closest way to the forest. Yeah, head towards the forest. Uh... <sighs> Exciting stuff. I feel like I could run for ages in this loadout, it's so light. Agreed. you want us to go. That looks good. Bravo team pick an LZ. Roger, field in front. 12 will be north. Oh wait, we'll put 12 east so it makes it easier on the setup. Roger that. Start setting up our perimeter and then we'll call the helo in. Yeah, we'll set up overhead and up. Charlie team, go to the north. That means we're going east, southeast on that perimeter. You guys good with that? Here we go. What do you go, Denav? Thank you. Charlie Roger team, that. Somebody park. Somebody pop a colored smoke. Already done. Hotel, this is Alpha, Bravo, and Charlie team requesting pickup. Marked with Maybe smoke, say color. Yellow. That is our LZ, you are clear to land. Helo, 2 1 inbound. All teams make ready for hotel. Charlie team prepared to. Uh, board when the chopper's landed. Get ready to reposition everybody in case. Reposition. Charlie team, move. She does not like slowing down. And I thought that flare was beautiful. Bravo, mount up, get you guys in there. Charlie's almost in. Bravo Alpha, close it up. Charlie team on board. Bravo in. Yeah, Charlie team on board. Alpha now. Alpha 3 on board. Sorry guys, he kicked me out. I might have screwed it up. I grabbed the left position. I thought I was supposed to grab or she's supposed to be supposed to go right and back, right and back. <laughs> yeah, I thought we were left. Yeah, that's probably what got you kicked. So it's right and back is the number three guy. Right and then left. Be a good idea, wouldn't it? Works on paper. Yeah, so it's getting better. That was nice and fast, guys. Yeah, it was faster than the other day, at least. <laughs> so what we're going to do is we're going to land in a semi-hot LZ. I'm going to set one up for us. So we're going to bring it over the base, and I'll set it up on the map. I've got an LZ for us. I'm going to put some hot floor up there. Someone else said something, if it would be a good idea to watch. Should we have the demo in the um, camp? Demo in camp? Yeah. Go pick him up, pilot. Eight from. Yeah, that's going to add to uh, Charlie's team. Bravo, can Hold you get more? Hold on, I got to pull some J's. Or he can, he can drop into Bravo team. You need some smoke. For the We're going to make a smoke, yeah.
<sighs> Are you using a joystick, Devil? Blue smoke out? No. You don't, um, you don't announce the smoke, the pilot announces the smoke color, guys. <laughs> Get used to that. The pilot tells you what he sees, we don't tell him what we've done. Looks like we Whoa. might be switching to the chin hook. We're a little full here. Roger that. We'll switch over to the chin hook. Oh, you almost landed on the chin hook. <laughs> it's a very fast way to get inside. True. Okay, we're gonna have some light off for resistance. Teams, let's head over to the Chinook and go over the briefing and then we'll mount up. Don't mount yet, guys. Devil, the Chinook, not the Seeking. No, I wanted to play with this one. <laughs> Do we want to try the Seeking? Has it got Are enough, enough seats? Uh, I hope enough seats. Oh, oh hell yeah, there's loads in them. Alright, let's head over to the Seeking then. It's a hell of an aircraft. It's a Stallion, not a Seeking. Sorry, center down so Stallion, you're all right. Well, I think we were going to do the briefing first, weren't we? Yeah, we were going to brief up first so we can spin it down, spin it down. That's an orgasmic sound. <laughs> yes, oh, yes it is. <laughs> Sounds better than a joke. <laughs> yeah, it's a hell of an aircraft. <laughs> Alright, let's check our maps. <sighs> okay. If you look to the southwest, you'll see the town of Kalochiri. Got it. This poor city. We've been uh, with doing a quick patrol of the town. It's been known to have some hostile forces. What we're going to do is a, a simple patrol. To the three waypoints? Yes. Yep. Yep. And then the pickup point. So we're landed at LZ1. We're going to move to waypoint 1, waypoint 2, and waypoint 3. Patrol in the town. And then okay. we'll call in the helo. But what we're going to do is we're going to play a kind of a dirty trick. We're going to land the helo, protect it, have it dust, and then it'll come back and it'll let Devil dismount so he can join us for the mission. <laughs> and then we will, uh, I'll teleport Devil back to the helicopter at the LZ, and then we'll call him in for the sec for the pickup after we've done the patrol. Does that work for everybody? Yeah, Devil went yeah, AFK. Really you need good. to remind him when he gets back. That way we're not losing everybody. Yeah. Here's the thing. Should we switch it to nighttime or dusk? If we Not do easy. nighttime, I don't think I have enough illumination flares for a patrol that long. You don't have to illuminate everything all the time. Most right, of us so are packing Gen it. 1 night vision. We should get used to it. I'll need to go pick some probably go grab some. Though. Okay. Let's yeah, uh, switch this to dusk then, so guys, go grab your gear, and then I'll set, change the time. I'm going to put some more Op 4 down, get more entertaining for us. The guys we're facing today are FIA. They are troublesome. No Viet Cong. I don't have Charlie. Oh. If I did, I would. Believe me, I'd have them set up. I'd like to fight Charlie again. They were always good guys to fight. The enemy is known to have some vehicles, so be advised we might be facing some...
vehicle mounted systems. If you haven't had a chance yet, take out that L72, take a look at it. I believe you have to reload it before you can fire it. Hey, firm. So the sights are really rudimentary, so you'll have to set them. While we're waiting, does anyone know which um, menu the earplugs uh, command is set? It's under self equipment. Uh, uh, it's it, on the server, just push backspace. Uh, sorry, it's um, pause break. Pause break yeah. if you haven't got it set up that way. Where is that key set? Do we know? I've got a clash. Alright, uh, next door to your scroll, scroll lock up there. Yeah, I know where the key is, but do you know where, which menu uh, sets that key? Yeah, hold on. Uh, it's not actually, it's set by the server, it's not set on the uh, key binding. Ah, uh, roger that. That's why when you load in it tells you uh, push um, pause break to put your earplugs in. And who said the AT tube only have a range of 50 meters? It's 350 on the side. Yeah, it's, it starts off at 50, then you can adjust it. Which AT tube? The M72. 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 It's telling me 50 meters on the little yeah, you, thing. Yeah, you can adjust the uh, ranging. Yeah, you press page up, page down to adjust the sights on it. Alright, that would have been useful information. Consider yourself informed. <laughs> Consider myself informed after I've tried it multiple times in Anastasia to get this thing to nail things at fucking 300 meters by aiming into the sky. <laughs> This is annoying, I don't have motorized guys. Uh, Sib, do you hear me? Uh, no I cannot. Oh, please don't come use. Bring the 1911. Uh, oh, yeah, the Browning 9mm. Always the 1911. Unfortunately the AI in this game uh, don't react to getting shot, so it doesn't do what it does in real life. Seeking, you know, deleting it and putting a new one down. <laughs> it has no flaws anymore. Oh boy. Did you yeah, say for the fuel? Really? Yeah, I carry it, packed it. <laughs> Damned annoying sometimes, isn't it, when you uh, look down at your magazine wheel. and find out that it's the wrong magazine. Which magazine? On the M60. Yeah, you're which using one 100 you... round mags. Yeah, yep. if you look down at your mag, it says it's 200 round. Hmm. Yeah, the printer got it wrong. Cartridges. <laughs> that was weird what happened yesterday on the server. What happened? We, we were playing last night and all halfway through the mission all our ammunition disappeared. Oh, Whoa. they got that, yeah. Ammunition, explosives. We what ended up with 6.5mm uh, mags instead of 7.62. I had oh, to no. grab one weapons we ordered. Well, I didn't even end up with. I was using five, five, six, and and I just had none at all. Yeah, yeah it just disappeared. That's, that's what happened with me. And the yeah, trouble is, the trouble is that screwed me right up because I swapped my gun out, yeah, for a AK. Yeah. And then when they dropped an arsenal, I hadn't saved that. So oh, no. <laughs> it was then a nightmare. After that, it was just shit, shit, wet. I mean, yeah. Went to shit. Yeah. Yeah. That's horrible. Is everybody back? I think yeah, so. so. Back. The 1911 is a good choice in handgun. It's just a shame yeah, the AI don't react two. like they would in real life, where if you put one in their you fucking wheel, they'd down, they down dead. Yep. Devil, you pushing red? Yep. So just go test the demo. <sighs> oh, okay. Like he went back to the 80s and got one of those yep. crazy haircuts. Yeah. It's my rest outfit. <laughs> you know, one sleeves up, mate. The only thing is, I don't think I got the right uniform. I don't know what you guys are wearing. The Pemberets. You. Yeah, you got the right uniform. You just got different coloured uh, vest. vest on. If you find a nightclub, you can go first. <laughs> <laughs> they love you a long love time. You long? Oh. <laughs> No. <laughs> 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 this is going to be a bunch of full metal jacket memes at this point. 
isn't it? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Go to the I top I am off. in a world of shit. I just can't wait until we have to call Broken Arrow. <laughs> No, it's no fun. Uh, I'm pretty sure right, we're here we go, British, aren't we? I don't think we can do that. <sighs> I, I, don't know I mean, we British, can still do it. Uh, I don't know what the British alternative to Broken Arrow is, actually. I don't think there is a British alternative, because the British were a lot Those are actually really good night fishing goggles. Mm. Uh -huh. This isn't bad. Uh oh. The night fishing not that bad. <laughs> it's too bad, yeah, the night it's too good, we good. have to change them. Yeah. I gotta find some shit. What are you using, Jedra? Yeah, we at need the black aura around it, I'm using the BAF ones. Yeah, it works a bit. Alright, is everybody what? ready to be blind? What, what, what night vision goggle is that? Don't do that. Uh, it's the, uh, head mounted NV system, BAF. BAF. It's a single mode. They are just really good. Aren't bad. I've just I'm using the general ones. Yeah, uh, these are okay. better than what they should be. I have to admit, for Gen 1, yeah, they're way better. They're actually better than the Gen 4s that I usually wear. Don't don't get to put out for that morning. Offbound F3 shit. 2, custom function 2, and it's not working. Did you clear F3 from any other bind? Really nice. Did you clear F3 from any other bindings? Yeah, yeah it was in command controls, I've deleted it out of there. Yeah, I don't think we've got the new mod list yet. Yeah, when we get the new boss, I'm gonna carry a lot of flares and hand Try flags. like an, Are you an arrow key or something like that. Is that it. really all that illumination flare lasts for? That's such a short Yeah, like I, I, yeah. I reckon but, the, the up arrow to the seven don't seven use the is. arrow keys to play, you know? So clear the movement from the up arrow and so I have the up arrow has got the two. We'll keep these night visions for now, but we'll have to find out what the story is and what we're gonna be using for the campaign. Yeah, I'm disappointed that that illumination left in like two minutes. And it's yeah, kind of logical because you like when yep. you go into something, you, you like my good luck charm, you know? Easy to remember. Say again? You like my good luck charm weapon. I really wish I could shoot you. Oh man, do we have to get you see it in my first person? Mm. Yep. Oh, I, I can see it. Do you like it? Ah, uh, it's just got riding back. Oh, so it means you gotta time it. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, like that. Mm -hmm. So, when you approach the aircraft with your group, it goes in reverse numerical order. And then just go up, hit it, and then the next guy counts one, two, and then he hits it, and so on and so forth. It's gonna be a little bit screw up. Oof. Yeah, that All works. teams mount the helicopter! Uh, that's, that, that, that's not the right mounting, you will say. Charlie team, mount up! <laughs> Devil almost chewed me up in the rotors because I was having some climbing fun. <laughs> Bravo and Alpha mount up. Charlie no, team sound off if you're on board. Atlas is on board. Oh, I'm on board. I'm shooting. P9 in. Bravo in. Jedra in. Charlie team in. Motherfucking buckshot apparently. All teams are mounted. Still one man outside. Okay, get him in there. You guys probably know better than me. We've got 24 seats in the back. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. The, um, the uh, M16A1GL is good because it's got the 203, yeah, which is period specific. Uh, seems like everyone's on. Shall Looks I like good. All teams, we're going to be heading to a hot LZ. Prepare to dismount into your zones. Three piece zone. Alpha. Yeah, no, I'm blind. At one o'clock. Bravo. Five o'clock. Charlie. Nine o'clock. Be prepared to take fire. Call out your contacts on 100. Watch that. A defend is in. Thirty seconds. There's the town. Oh boy.
Can you turn that off, please? Who <laughs> 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 duct tape speakers to this thing again? <laughs> Ten seconds. Prepare to dismount. Charlie, Charlie team to the south. Charlie team to the south. Oh, for fuck's sake. Dust, dust, dust. Don't fire flares on our LZ, that's fucking crazy. Sorry. <laughs> Jeez, that was not the button I was looking for. <laughs> Jesus Christ! No contacts in sight from Charlie. Roger that. Scan the perimeter. Looks clear for me. Alright, let's make our way northwest towards waypoint one. Bravo team. Then, uh, yeah, Bravo. Charlie Alpha, like we did in that little quick walk. Bravo team, you're going to be traveling over watch. Charlie team, give them 50 meter space. Formation and speed. Nice trot, not too fast. And formation. I'm not in charge of your fire team. Uh, okay, let's go with you, so my ride. North, uh, northwest. Yeah, man. Okay, Charlie team, uh, I would say in this field... Yeah, I'm in that, uh, you. Yeah, we're gonna push a little far to get to that wall over there. Here goes Alpha. What Here formation are Alpha using? Usually wedges for all these for, sort of open for rain formations. Yep, Charlie form wedge. We're gonna be in a wedge as well. Bravo, Bravo. Hope to take the back left. Bravo, we'll keep moving up, cautious advance. Charlie team's coming in, traveling over, watch behind you. King back on comms, I'm in the Eddie Stealth with the uh, devil. That's the FK for a minute. Roger that. Um, he's going to bring the helo and land it back at the LZ. Let's move, guys. Charlie team hold a little bit, we'll just give them a bit more space. We're the sixth guard. Hotel, you're clear to come in and land, reset, join your team. Okay, we'll go. I have one slight problem, I have blue we'll blood go. and I can't see the bloody map. You have to carry a flashlight. God damn. You're one of your team guys that's got a flashlight to navigate. Oh yeah, I, I actually brought a maglite, how the hell do I use it? Self-interaction uh, uh, when you're on the map. Yeah, go to self-interaction on the map, and you'll see flashlight. So I'm loading illumination in the GL. Team leads, any contacts? Bravo, no contact. Charlie, no contact. Yeah, yeah Bravo, right, about 150 meters. Guys and Pope, guys and Pope, on you guys now. Bravo is crossing the road and then we're swinging direct west. Uh, be advised, the scope is not compatible with NV. So I am pretty much shooting blind. Yep, well, you get in town. It's walking pace, okay? Roger that, it's fine. Nice easy patrol, keep you guys in cover. Charlie, let's move. Alpha's up. Charlie's on the move. Charlie's moving. I put Bobble's moving. Alpha's moving. Yep, we're Alpha. Yeah, I screwed that up. Hey. Hey, you're on the front. They're way up ahead of us. Bravo lead, uh, 
Your number three man's coming in, far from behind. Sure, we can hold up and wait for him. Roger that. Alley team, hold. Let's... Until they start moving again. We can head down, just parallel the road. And then branch off for the waypoint. I missed my scope. Bravo, stepping off in 3, 2, 1. Charlie team, move. Alpha's up. They look at, uh, okay. Charlie team looks if they're moving west now, west. Roger that. Never try and use voice as much as you guys can. Repeat your orders back and forth to each other with voice. And I expect that from you guys to repeat your orders with voice. Moving. Three. Across the road. Three across. Roger that. It's in quiet. Looking good. Anything to report? Negative, no visual at this point. Roger that. Charlie team, we're gonna let them, uh, let Bravo move ahead. We're a little Roger. bit close to them. Maintain security 360. Three. Alpha's up. Alpha's moving. Three. Yeah, we're kind of falling into their formation, but let them get ahead. Bravo spotted someone running, bearing south in between the middle wings. Roger that. Armed? Unknown. Roger that. There are armed. civilians on site. Contact, armed, contact, armed. contact, I see armed men, uh, south-southwest, 200 um, meters. Roger that. One, Bravo two, official. two, two men. Yeah, come Charlie set up a linear ambush on those guys. Charlie team, let's, uh, there's a wall in front of me, let's go to this wall. Moving right. Be advised, uh, the hostile troops are Three. advancing east. Roger that. Let's take our cover. Alpha's moving right. Yeah, contact. Armed infantry heading east. Permission to engage. Distance? About two, three hundred meters. Let's let them get within 150. If we can get into the town before we start shooting, it'll be better because we, we're out in the open. Hey, fam. Can you move your team up stealthy? We can try. Roger that. Uh, do bounding overwatch. Have other guys keep them covered. You take fire, then you're free to engage. Moving. Yeah, Bravo can uh, hold and provide overwatch. Three. Roger that, Bravo. Try and get towards the city as best you can. Enemy Ooh. troops, according to a definite, no longer Three. eyes on. Copy that. Try and move up towards their last known position. We'll, re we'll re rally once we're towards the town. Alpha's gone far right flank. Yep. Don't worry, I'm not gonna 
run over you. Let's move up to that wall. Three. User entered your channel. Friendly to our west. Yep. That's good. That's Bravo team. Charlie's to our left. We got troops in the open, uh, bearing south in the streets, sir. What's the bearing? No distance. I think Probably I'm... about 200 meters. Roger that. See if we can close it, guys. We want to take them out really fast and really hard. And be close enough to the town and get him for cover. Enemy troops at one, three, six meters. <laughs> three moving. Moving. We're about a hundred meters from them. Permission to engage. Take them. He went. What is he gonna have? What is he gonna have? Yeah, I'm just on safety, I'll stand by. Jesus, that's not accurate. Is that another technical right, thing? Waypoint 1's been checked, it has been cleared. Moving towards waypoint yeah. 2. Charlie, another team, technical, situation? another technical. Okay, guys, you're good. Thank you. These illumination players last, like, for two seconds. Dinav, where are you? Where are you? Technical north. Yeah, I'm here, I'm here. Yeah, I see you. Good. Are you good? Are you good? Same tech, I'll have vehicle behind. Get in cover, Nav, I'll stitch you. Oh. Engage, technical north. Yeah, we're gonna let him cover our probe. Frag out. Frag out. I'm setting up on the window here. They know where we're at. We gotta yeah, we gotta get moving. You're good, Nav. Thank you. 
got them. For everyone okay? Can someone uh, use one of the packs out of my inventory on me? Okay, cross your line. Copy. Jesus Christ. Oh. Alpha teams, moving southeast. Two moving. Three moving. Oh, I'm down, I'm down. Injured. I got hit, where are you? Alpha's... Right by there's a, a slide, a kid's slide. We're in the building that way, southeast. Roger, I'm away. Need a stitch. Take it out. I hope. There's your this building is clear. Okay. Oh shit. Is that a friendly? You want me to stitch your sim? RPG ready. Guy. I can have a back on me for this one. Inside. Yeah, give me a stitch. Be advised, they do, the, fort, the enemy forces, some of them do look like NATO. Here it so comes. Check your targets. Contact strap. Bravo, what's your status? You guys moving up towards the uh, next. next. Yeah, we just had to get clear of the compound. We're clear of the compound now. I'm thinking right. we're moving a little southwest and then we're gonna move down that street there. Taking enemy Take from the back. I need a stitch in return. Yeah, oh shit. 
one moment. I'm just trying to get some stuff working on this damn thing. What's your position? Uh, I'm pulling the thing across from me. Yeah, Roger. Can you make it to us or are you injured? I'm waiting for you guys. I'm waiting to go south. Charlie is effective again and combat ready. Roger that, Charlie. Alpha's almost to you. We're moving. Alpha's moving. Yeah, I was thinking we should swing around south west, Devil. Come up here. I've got eyes on Charlie. Yeah, move towards him. Devil, yep. Next building, come on. Yeah, I'm good. I'm just wondering why my team isn't moving to you guys. User in your channel timed out. Three over. One's here, moving. Three. We're on the street, guys. Check those doors. Friendlies, friendlies. Doors and windows, doors and windows. Contact to the southwest in the friendlies, compound. Friendlies. Be on the gate. Go you. Crossing. What's the range on that compound? The one directly in front of us west. This is bright. Jesus, we're loaded. We have Alpha chat. Crossing. Charlie, this is Alpha. We're at your location. Charlie, Alpha, go ahead. Let's continue on to waypoint three. Alpha, we're nearly at waypoint 2, so we Maybe will move to waypoint 3. Roger. Shit, where is he? Uh, Bravo's clear on the building, uh, facing the second street. He's behind building... Contact down. Charlie, move to waypoint 3, over. We're heading west, yeah? Yeah. Roger that, Charlie. Through the town or around the town? Building clear. He's in the building right in front of us. So. Shit. User entered your channel. Can you see him? I think he went inside. Okay. Probably. Yeah, probably we're gonna push. Uh, down southwest around the way with the others. He looks down actually. There's a body I can see. I see a uh, friendly is down the street. What are you shooting at, Dnav? The friendly is down there. Moving. Crossing. Yep, Charlie's on the on the outside perimeter. Three crossing. Charlie, we're, okay. we're in, Charlie, we're inside the village from you guys, uh, trying to basically okay. parallel your path. Who are we missing? Where's, where's Jedra? Jed's, be Jed's behind you. Right behind you. Oh shit, they are, pal. Sorry. I'm going over the wall. Yep. Let's go. It'll be an easy patrol, they said. <laughs> <laughs> it's always easy. Well, it's been easy so far. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I only got shot twice. Check the buildings. Yeah, that technical had no Cut. balls for you. Friendly! Friendly fire. So Charlie waiting on pause, ready to go. Devil's down, devil's down. Good him, Ouch. <laughs> Good shot. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I yelled friendly when we were at yeah. the wall there, but yeah. not near us. Yeah, I never heard him. Good. ID, always ID. <laughs> Good, eh? Friendly's out that way too. Shit. They're crossing. I am friendly shooting at him. He just got hit in the head. Where did he come from? Oh. Shit. Jack, fuck. Where is his shooter? Are we sending clears up? Yep, that's yes, elimination. Yes. That's friendlies, that's friendlies. Got a mass casualty. Mass casualty here. We got hit by friendlies. Check if he has a pulse, dude. Uh, oh my god, I'm dying. Uh, I'm dying. Sim, what's your location? Uh, into the village from you guys. Uh, oh, okay. jeez. Uh, we're gonna try and... We're gonna try and get, uh... Where is the... Uh, 
an illumination flare. Yeah. Anybody I've got packed, a flare? I packed the bloody... Hey, these look like they're to our just... Shit. East, just east of north in this village. Where is my fucking UB? Is it not giving it? Nope. Is yeah, mine's not either. Right. CPR. Oh god. Okay, I'm gonna do a pack. Hit him with up an effort and hit him with up an effort. I'm patching Navot, but you'll just need to stitch him in. Epi injected. That did it. No, I'm no hard. Oh, okay, I'm using a personal on him. Yep. I'll do CPR to keep him going. Red. Shit. Check on chest. CPR. The Nav, you good? Nav still. I'm treating him. Uh, heart rate none. He's gonna need. Yeah, Charlie, what's your situation? We're moving up, Whoa. Paul's just taken a bit of injury, so I've just been treated. We're moving up towards waypoint 3. Roger that, we're 100 and 200 meters, uh, looks like, northeast of waypoint 3. Nav is back up, I'm just treating We look as if we're to the southeast of waypoint 3. So we're quite a way ahead of you. Roger. Is that you well ahead of us? Roger, focus that was and a few others. Damn it. Sam, Charlie team, let's move up. Hang on. Where are you? Don't I'm get too spread out, please, guys. It looks like we've got one friendly already at waypoint three, way ahead of us. What? Roger that, folks getting eyes on waypoint three, and we'll cover your arrival. Yeah, I'm bleeding bad. Hope, and Delta I'm team, so not Delta, Hades are quite a long way behind us. So we Bravo are quite yeah, a long we, way behind us. Yeah, we got tangled up in a, in a crossfire. And then it looks like somebody else opened fire on us, possibly from your team. This is going good. You're good. The only yeah. fire I sent your way was a red illumination, so. Uh oh. Yeah, I think Charlie's quite far away from you. How's Charlie team doing? We're doing good. Dyson and I have pushed up a little bit further to scout ahead. Well done, thank you. Thank you. We're set on this wall. And I am I'm gonna need a stitch over here. Yeah, I can stitch you. No, no, yeah, no. that works. Thank you. I'm gonna finish up the leg. Thanks, pal. You're good. Where's Jed? Stitching. There you are, pal. Stitching him now. We are 25%. Done. Has this... Nothing ahead of Dyson and I have been cleared. Stitching you, Sim. Thanks. Taking it off. No, I'm good now. Can you guys hear me at all? Yep. Okay, Bravo, you guys are good to go. Packing you. I need work. Yep. Do I need packing? Damn. 50. 60. When you need Jedra. 90. Done. I lost blood and I need stitching, right. I think. Right. Your head's bleeding. Oof. Packing you, Sim. I should be good. Yeah, stitch you up. You said heaps of blood. Oh, thanks. Surgical kit on you, Jedra. Did, yeah, there I'm you already stitching. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Blood so blood yeah, I'll get double stitched up. <laughs> Charlie team, do not get spread out. We need to secure Stay the area up. by... Waypoint 3, we're clearing oh, buildings. Very good. Coming back. Okay. Thank you. Oh, I'm good. Go. Uh, be advised there's an enemy contact in the building, just uh, oh. here to the north. I see it. Yep. I got it, so put an HE uh, grenade on the building. Oh, okay, got him. That. Gunfire to the north. Clearing back. buildings. We had enemy inside of buildings. Be careful. Pop it. Clear. Get under cover, it looks like mortar's coming in. I think that was shrapnel. Yeah, bro. moving. Bro was ready. That might Good also up. be Three. Hades clearing buildings as they're moving up towards us. Negative, uh, we didn't throw any grenades or launch anything. Uh, Atlas just said that it was him. 
Where did Devil go? Just here. He's, he he looks around. Blind? I'm moving. Ah, oh, Raj. <laughs> yeah, tough lot. Danger intersection. Cross. Get across this thing. Moving. Three crossing. Go. Go. Sprint it, sprint it, sprint it. Oh boy. We're gonna get gunfire, guys. What's going on? Contact building. Enemy down. Good. We had one shoot out of a window, hit my team, but we cleared it. Reloading. Good response, guys. That was nice. Crossing. Crossing. Fast, stop lagging. Sorry. With you. Set. Moving. Alpha and Bravo are 100 meters from waypoint 3. Crossing. Charlie team just securing Danger waypoint crossing. 3. Eyes on me. Roger that, Charlie. Come this way, put the eyes on PID. Yep. Make sure we're good with that security this time. Please over there. Cross. Go, Jed. Crossing. I've got behind you. Go. Three Crossing. over. Crossing. Go. Sprint it. Sprint it. Crossing. Moving, yeah, friendlies up there shooting. Watch. Watch this exit. Crossing the line. Looks good. Move it. Crossing Vaz. User in your chat. We see flashes, is that Charlie? Touch dice hand. Roger, just taking lights out. So Roger, I have eyes on you. Roger, that. we're there. User joined your channel. See it. I'm stuck there. God damn it. <laughs> That's what I said last night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you get your dick caught in a bottle? Oh no, I got stuck between um, some crates. It was bad. I got Whoa, who's doing laps on the That's floor? Sim. No, it's no, sick. <laughs> I keep getting stuck in these trees. There's nothing weird here. My dog does All that. All right, Charlie. Uh, Alpha and Bravo are at your position. We're going to continue doing our sweep. Alpha lead. Bravo go tail. Charlie in the middle. Bravo copy. Which direction are we moving in? We're going to move southwest to pick up one. I'm going to teleport our... Uh, actually, Charlie and Bravo team start moving to pick up one. I'm going to teleport the pilot to LZ1 to get the helo. Hey, firm. Charlie team on the move. Okay. To get a bit Be advised, I have two more white illuminations. What speed do you want us? Just normal... Yeah, normal pace, get out there, secure the area, and uh, I'll send out our pilot. What's distance to LZ? Oh, 300, 350 meters. I uh, just wanted to know for my arcs. Where is that goddamn thing? Oh, what's that? I don't know. Copy that. Ah, 
crap, I need blood. Who was I? Jedra. Which ones are the ones you're using, Pope? I'm using the ones all the way at the bottom of the list. Yeah, you go, Devil. Mean. Are we going to be using smoke to mark LZ since it's, like, nighttime? Uh, we still should toss one out there. Uh, I think a few of us are holding the handheld signals. They should be They tie those. Hulu is pulled, ready to dust. Alpha, let's get out of here. Ready to go. Uh, team, let's mo move to the outside, guys. Yeah, well, let's move. Mm, moving. Removing. Yeah, the LZ is just behind this bit. Yeah, they're booking you guys. So. Which bearing is our 12 o'clock so Charlie can set up? Incoming Make it north. Outside south. Yeah, we've got tracers coming in from southeast. Make a that's the line. Let's go off of Bravo. Yeah, we're sprinting. Contact Check your fire, make sure you're not friendly. Up. ID targets. I'm not shooting at friendly, it's definitely marked red dots on map. Roger that. Char Thor's got contacts to the uh, south. South running HE. Charlie team, Charlie team, Alpha's got by the helo. Fall back to our position. Green lights out for position. I'm Watch not seeing shit because I'm hit. It's a hot LC, hot LC. Okay, see the lights. to the helo. Alpha, Bravo, start closing the perimeter. Maintain fire on target sector. Charlie, Charlie team, pull back to the helicopter. Last man, move. Bravo, Alpha, let's keep pulling in, folding in. Charlie team doing? Atlas is that chopper. Bravo team prepare to mount as soon as Charlie's on. Charlie team get in please. Load up. Alpha 3 on board. Alpha 2 on board. The man down. Whoa! Good job, boys. You're late for the dust. <laughs> We're all on board, thank God. Anybody got any here. blood? <laughs> Check the passages. Jedra needs blood.
Back to base, RTB. Yeah, my medical shit ain't working. That's weird, because I gave position permission yeah. to the guys. Yeah, it's only giving me like the basic readout on pulse and blood pressure as well. It's bug. Okay. I can only self-interact. Someone give me blood real quick before I pass out. Who's I? Jedra. Jedra. Yeah, I've been trying to give it to you. Leads when you're near the helicopter. I'm not sure why. I'm not getting the option. Can someone use a pack on me, please? Blood. More going in now, another up later. Thank you. Here. Atlas, you glitched into the ground there, mate. <laughs> okay. So, let's go over what, how, what happened. Starting with, uh, let's go reverse. Charlie team, how'd it go? We uh, came into contact as we were moving towards the waypoint two. We engaged the enemy and then we discovered quite a lot more enemy within the buildings that we cleared eventually after getting quite badly hit. But I thought once we got casualties sorted out, I thought we did okay. It's just weird using these weapons and whatnot. Yeah, definitely uh, a learning experience. Bravo team? Yeah, did a patrol towards the town, uh, spotted the enemies, uh, good uh, coordination on that. Uh, took engagement uh, when we were in that compound, we got a little buggered down, spent a little time there, treating, shooting, treating and more some more. Uh, Alpha, you moved out. Uh, I wanted to take my team to swing out the back entrance since the main entrance was kind of hot. Uh, Devil didn't get the memo, I guess. And uh, so we waited a little bit for him, caught up with him, and we moved through the town, ran away with you, and yeah. Okay. So, Alpha team. Uh moved up with the flank behind Charlie and then got over and rejoined with Bravo by waypoint one. Uh, Charlie team did a nice ambush on the op four, but as I expected, the op four responded to the sounds of our weapon fire and really quickly sent reinforcements, including several vehicles, which came in from the north of waypoint one, I believe, and assaulted our position. And once they knew where we were, they even had dismounted troops attacking, so we got really tangled up. Then on our way to we joined with Charlie team, we got shot up, I think, possibly by Op 4, I'm not 100%. And then, uh, while well, Bravo, Bravo was sweeping in through the town, Alpha shot and injured <laughs> Bravo members. And then while we were treating, we took a fragmentation grenade and nearly killed both fire teams. Then we moved up, rejoined with Charlie finally. Uh, did a really good bounding road crossing where we were engaged by Op 4 and we eliminated it. Did anybody get hurt in that road crossing at Elfham Bravo? Nope, that was good. Good. So that's the negative of that speed, right? So as soon as that guy opened up, we I think everybody that had a weapon shot at the son of a bitch, which is perfect. And then uh, we finished the sweep, had a hot LZ, which Charlie was maintaining really well. Helicopter landed short. Um, 
Charlie had a break, Elf and Bravo maintained security, and we were able to dust the helicopter approximately a minute after it landed, which ain't bad for a short landing. So good piloting by Devil, nice job, it was hot LZ, so I was hoping you'd wave off, but uh, no big deal, we survived. So what did we learn? Two things. Uh, we're used to using silenced weapons, and it shows. Our tactics are, we're engaging when we don't have superior firepower, and we're engaging at times when we're out in the open and we can't move. So when we engage with noisy weapons, the AI responds incredibly quickly. That really hurts, that flare. So we have to adjust our tactics. That's why I was trying, Charlie did a really good job maintaining their fire control until they were within 100 meters and then they eliminated that first group. But we should have moved faster at that point. Same with Alpha and Bravo, when we engaged our first UAZ and took it out, we didn't pack up our gear quick enough and move away, and so the enemy swarmed us, and that took us a good, what, oh. four or five minutes to extricate. Charlie managed to thank the vehicles and take them from behind as well, so I thought that was pretty good. That's good. Yeah, we had the, the buggers came right through us and shot at us and shot us up. And then a uh, couple of dismounted infantry. I had one guy run literally right up to me within nose touching distance. And I was hitting my uh, F12 key, which is the one I use to straighten out my track IR. I couldn't get my gun on him. <laughs> 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 he was literally standing in front of me. And I'm looking at this guy that looked like an eye on my table or looking at me. And finally my weapon came up and I took him out. Yeah, so. I had a similar situation. I had the two, 203 recharged up and I was going to go around the corner on the back entrance to the compound and we got buggered down first. And then this AI came running r r like around the corner and he like just stands there. And I'm in the 203 and I'm like, fuck, I can't shoot with that. <laughs> they don't know what to do in hand-to-hand in -hand combat range, thankfully, or else nah. we'd be in real trouble. So, yeah, we're used to using silenced weapons and it shows. And we're going to have to User get unused your to that. What we can try and do is pack hush puppies for CQB and taking out lights. Sorry? I saw somebody taking out lights with a silenced weapon, like a hush puppy. But if we're going to do like this era, our long rifles are going to have flash suppressors. That's it. That's about all you can get on it. And that's just going to lock your nuzzle, muzzle flash down. So that means you shoot and you scoot. Why is my but, heart beating? Uh, we can use compressor uh, compensators and. Um, muzzle brakes too if you're using a shotgun for whatever reason. Yeah. But those are, again, kind of rare. And yeah. Only effective in CQB. If you want to pack one for CQB, definitely, okay? Speaking of uh, CQB, um, are we going to do another training with that? Preferably with um, a little more of a SWAT mentality than bust down the door with your boot and shoot everything in the room? Uh, if you want to do it again, we can do it again. Right now, um, I'm not sure what is going to be entailed in the campaign. Because I know, I know Thor campaign. got shot today blue on blue because he came through a door of balls blazing. Yeah, there's problems with that. We didn't, we had problems even between the teams TID and just like the other day in the mission when I blew up a uh, friendly vehicle. Yeah. We got to really work on our maintaining our fire discipline. Um, and it's tricky. And yeah. we got to, we got to get used to that whole idea of target, identify, aim, and fire in that order. Which is that, impossible with these MVGs. It's tricky. Um, Which is why yeah, I was popping illumination almost all night. I was trying to keep the MVs off as much as possible. Yeah. And also, I'm kind of spoiled. I'm so used to using my uh, GPS that I got confused when I go to the map. So it slowed me down. Um, I'm used to the GPS also for telling me where the other fire teams are, which is, again, bad, because if we're not going to have them in the next campaign, it's a bad idea to get used to them. Yeah, so, in the town, um, I, I lost track of where all the uh, other teams were. Yep. Yeah, and I was popping where, back and forth between the map. All that's night. where we got to start getting used to using bearings off of the waypoint markers on the map. I was trying to do that with Charlie team to make sure that I wasn't stepping on them or surprising them. So... Uh, a good idea is to take the waypoint markers and then say my team is 300 meters approximate west of that of waypoint two or something like that then the other team should be able to look at the map and say okay shit they're right in front of us or they're behind us to our right so team leads get used to that other members glance at it from time to time when you hear it come over the comms it's a good practice and again 
when we are not reliant on our tech, we got to get used to that. Someone again, remind me to really pack sure. a flashlight. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I recommend the flashlight. <laughs> I did. Uh, I did that the pack flashlight <laughs> fast. Okay. So it's the Fulton is the one that I use on my map. I don't use a mag light. I use um, mag light. The mag light's I lighter, I believe. Uh, yeah, I should, yeah, should, should be the Fulton. On the map as well. Not a, it doesn't light up everything, just a small ring. Of yeah, so the there is advantages to it. Like, see, I've got that Fulton in it. I'm going to look at my map right now. Do you guys see it all up? No. But it's red. Yep, it's red. Makes so it's a little bit confusing reading. when you look at the map. See, there it is. Uh, same before we had that friendly. Uh, did you hear us? Uh, hear me call out friendly to your north? I heard you, and I was saying, and that's when my auto gunner shot. Oh, yeah, because I called it. Yeah, he saw, saw it. he saw movement. And he shot, which is <laughs> a good thing. But yeah, not yeah. when we've got friendlies in the zone. Yeah, and the this is again don't work when you're dealing with either the launchers or the MGs. The MGs just. Once you start yeah, firing, okay. you can't hear a damn thing, even yeah. with your plugs. So yeah. it's, it's, we're going to work on it. It's getting better. Really pleased with my primary focus today was mounting and dismounting the helo in a quick and orderly fashion. Maybe not perfectly orderly, uh, but quickly. And uh, we definitely up. improved massively on that from the other day. So remember, guys, if your team is going on the helicopter, if you hear that announcement, bust your ass. Break off the engagement and run. Don't wait. Okay? Yeah, what, is, what went wrong the other day was that Stalk should have picked me up and carried me to the chopper. He didn't. He just left. Uh, he treated me on the ground. And that's why it took so long on the... Yep. Uh, everyone had to wait. He should have picked me up and just carried me to the chopper. And that's the other thing. Yeah, we didn't really practice that today, um, which is loading in people into the aircraft and stuff like that. Has everybody ever done that? Yeah. It works uh, sometimes. I've done it, yeah. Is that AC awesome. Direct? Yeah, it's Ace Interact, Other, and... I remember doing that on Anastasia with you, but I had to, because I drove us right to that roadblock. Yeah, I remember that. <laughs> and yeah, that sometimes we have to do something like that. It's a nightmare. Uh, permission to incapacitate someone? Uh, you can hit me as soon as I hit you. <laughs> <laughs> do it! Oh, I think he's... I think you're gonna hope you didn't kill him. <laughs> that, was, that was like a 7.62 to the face. <laughs> He's gonna need a heal off getting this. He's gonna need something. <laughs> Don't worry, I can pack him. <laughs> <laughs> and off they go with the newlyweds. <laughs> that didn't yeah. work. Did I drop him? <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> I think he came back too, and that's why you dropped him. Yeah, he uh, Zeus healed me. No, I didn't uh, Zeus here. Oh. Oh. Here, hold on, I'll help. I didn't either. Are you sure you're looking at the right person? Keep this oh, on the ground, right? Below that helo. I haven't touched him, he's still unconscious. Yeah, that's because I put three more rounds in him. Uh, there he's on there the we go. Load <laughs> <Very> patient. Sure. <laughs> By the way, Pope, you were mentioning something about other illumination players for the GL. Yeah, Which ones uh, are those? Because I was using the ones at the bottom of the list. I'll show you when you get back to the uh, armory. Okay. Yeah, let's so, uh... Anyone else want to get in the back? Uh, no, thanks. I'm good. No, we're good. I think DNAV's... If it means uh, it's 10.16... We can call it... DNAV's found the vodka already. So we can call it training for today, guys. Uh, thanks so much. That was good. Uh, it was a bit tough, but that was how we should train. So thanks, everybody, for showing up. Uh, I think that we improved, and uh, we definitely noticed, and I hope everybody takes away the uh, difference between silenced weapons and unsilenced and how the AI is affected. So remember that when we get in mission. When you open fire, you better have cover nearby, because as soon as you shoot, they're going to start coming. you got like 30 seconds grace before they hit you with everything they got. Those things are bright as hell. Yeah, they are. Those are the hand signals. Why are those brighter than the illumination flares? I don't know. Maybe because they're sitting on the ground? No, Alright, so Sim is out. I will see you guys all Tuesday for campaign day, hopefully. I hope we get yeah. the new mod list Monday, tomorrow. Yeah, we should be getting the mod yeah. list and our basic loadout Monday, hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Mm. I'll yeah. get a sword by then. Yeah. So we'll have to see what they, they want that from us. Yep. Okay, Sim, so are we getting like, a list of the new I'm off to you guys.
Okay, cheers guys. See you next time. I want to fly some helos. Yep. Right. Good work, everybody. That's it. Are we getting like a new, like a new unibomb list? Or is it we're trying to go out? Okay, here we go. So don't actually shoot anybody this time. User disconnected from your channel. User disconnected from your channel. No. Okay. Right, okay, that was it. Time to go. Pope, I'm heading to the arsenal if you want to come show me those uh, fires.